Two women from Oxford who never met before they started training will be spending the next four months alone on a kayak as they attempt to paddle all the way from the UK to the Black Sea. Kate Culverwell and Anna Blackwell will travel through 13 countries as they take on the 4,000 kilometre journey along canals and rivers. But first, they'll have to face their biggest challenge, crossing the channel. For the last five months, they've been training at the Falcon Canoe Club in Oxfordshire, where Jessica Bannum went to meet them. They might be perfectly in sync, but six months ago, these two women didn't even know each other. Now they're about to take on the biggest challenge of their lives, kayaking for more than 100 days with just each other for company. It was Kate who came up with the idea. Two years ago, her dad passed away from pancreatic cancer and she wanted to find a way to make a difference. I'm just one story out of, you know, the 10,000 patients that get diagnosed every year. And, you know, every hour someone dies from this disease, so it's not just me. And no one's really talking about it, and it's hardly getting any funding, any attention, and it needs to change. It really does. They've been training since November and spend on average 12 hours a week on the water. Then there's the three gym sessions they do as well. It's all to prepare for this epic journey. They'll cross the channel before making their way inland, through four capital cities and hundreds of locks. But it's not the first time Anna has taken on a challenge like this. She's already trekked across the wilderness of Arctic Sweden and hitchhiked to Morocco. She actually replied to an advert Kate put online asking for help. I really, really love adventure um, and pushing myself. That's a really important thing in my life is uh, just kind of pushing myself outside of my comfort zone and seeing what I'm capable of physically but also mentally and going on a big trip like this where you're in an extreme environment at times and you know you'll be really challenged in a daily basis um, I just I love being in that environment but it's not just about the adventure as well as raising money for pancreatic cancer action they'll also be collecting water samples for a citizen research project I say we need to stop putting limitations on girls and we need to start encouraging them and hopefully by encouraging our expeditions, you know, two women doing something like this, we can hopefully inspire other young girls to get up and organise things themselves and go outdoors. If they succeed, Kate and Anna could well set a world record and they'll start the attempt in London on April the 21st. Jessica Bannum, BBC South Today.